something happened to me really interesting and cool the other day. This was like probably last weekend. I was like trying to figure out, you know, I was like cleansing my house. I have a whole scene that happened and I will do another video about that. But I need to, I need to just redo my altar. I'm gonna redo it. Spirit's telling me to redo it. So, hold on, I'm thirsty. And like some cold tea so i decided i was like let me go look in my crystal bowl right let me see what i have i need to put some oil in my hair by the way maybe we could do that while we talk and then i seen these two oh hold on this is what i use for my hair because everyone wants to know it smells so bomb okay but um i also use this too kaleidoscope miracle drops where my hair grew an inch and a half in a month and a half last time i did my hair like this i was like what am i gonna put on my altar and then last night there was a pink balloon in front of my door and i'm like why is there a pink balloon here right i looked all around there's no pink balloons anywhere to be found Okay, I'm really trying to figure out why I have a pink balloon. Can you guys see that? That was there yesterday. Now I woke up, there's another one. And I don't see anybody that has pink balloons anywhere. Where the fuck are these balloons coming from? I'm just, am I supposed to celebrate something? Is there something I don't know about? <laughs> so I was like, hmm, this is odd. So then the next morning, like I always do, like I did this morning, I, first thing I do is I wake up, I open my door, I let my cats go outside. So I open it and I'm like, there's another pink balloon. So I'm like freaking out and I'm texting my bestie. And I'm like, bitch. What is spirit telling me to go celebrate something? She's like, oh, it's your spirit guys, your ancestors, you know what I mean? After, especially this is like after something, like a whole nightmare I went through happened for like a whole month and a half. Ah, so, oh, that feels so much better. Let me get my baby hairs while I'm at it. Then, hold on. Clearly I can't talk and do these at the same time. Oh, and I also use this Queen Helen styling gel i was like okay she's like just take it as signs they're gonna be showing you signs so i was like okay cool i start looking and right where the pink balloon was i found crystals look at how pretty oh my god so beautiful funnies i've been finding these balloons in front of my house no one has balloons anywhere and they're just showing up what and they look really old i think there's more too i just gotta see it's like i gotta hunt oh there's a green one right there you see that green one i already have one so i'm just gonna leave that one there look at this it actually had a balloon sticker like earlier i'm like there has to be another one they're like can she find it and this is the other one i kept hearing there's one more and this was on the other side this is the side where all of, i found all of them and this is the other one and it just kind of made sense to me it was meaningful because of what had just transpired in my life and like what had just happened to me <laughs> for the month and a half it just kind of made me cry. I don't know. It was just, I take everything as a sign. And then I seen a hummingbird, a bee. I just keep seeing butterflies everywhere. So I guess that means like transformation. Like I'm going through a huge transformation. I don't know. I thought it was crazy. So literally I was crystal hunting in front of my house. Spirit was giving me a hint. So I washed all of them and put those on my altar. I know some, some of the jewels that i have in front of my house they're not all crystals they're like ones that you can buy like at the dollar store they're like these little circle you know what i'm talking about the clear circle little thing this whole time i lived here and i didn't even know this 
it's as if somebody else lived here that was like spiritual and I totally manifested living here. Manifestations are real. I was like visualizing how I was gonna have everything, where it's gonna be. I thought that was really interesting. And then, how are we looking? Are we looking a little better here? So another cool thing that happened was I found some jewelry in at my vanity, right? I, I literally had this jewelry years my mom and dad sent it to me when i was i don't know living in another apartment but i had this jewelry for a really long time and i actually found the bag and i'm like hmm what do i want to put on today in my vanity and i found these rings guys if you guys follow my other channel because you're after dark you know i'm all into spirituality and all these things so i have my mood ring right and i also found this ring and it has like a little chip on it and these are all real silver and then i also found this ring it says three six nine twelve i just thought it was so neat those are the holy trinity numbers and then i found this ladybug ladybugs are for good luck i don't know what this is because i'm fucking blind as a bat and i need like a magnifying glass and every time i try and stare at it i know it's hieroglyphics around it but i don't know what the center is i gotta get a magnifying glass to really figure out what it is because like i can't see up close and then i also found this cool ring too and literally they're all my birthstone too which is crazy. So now I actually appreciate these rings. I even gave some rings away to my friend because she was really into rings. I actually sent her some a couple of years ago for her birthday. I'm just like, oh my God, I got, I'm stuck with these ones. And it was like for a reason. I'm a, a girl that likes to wear gold. So I was wearing gold for years. And all of a sudden I just start liking silver. I don't know why, like everything's silver. And I gotta get new silver necklaces for my, what's it called again? Moldavite and my clear crystal quartz necklace that I always wear. So right now, for now, I'm just wearing this ohm. Friend gave this to me. You know what? I should really go to the store again. I'm always fucking shopping. I swear that's all I do is go shopping. So I might go to Michael's and just make myself a necklace or they have some pre-made already so I can put, you know what? The cats are so peaceful. I just don't want to bother them. Cause finally it's like, it's like, um, what do you call it? Cooling down. just kind of show you like what i mean by these little guess what guys i had to do everyone's like where the balloons go i don't know where one went one literally had left under the staircase and then it came back i don't know how it ended up back in my yard and then one just never left it's just getting smaller and smaller and smaller and then these are the little things that i was talking about that are like you know the ones that you could buy at the dollar store